men's rights activists? It's been a while since I have last made one of these videos. So, let's get it started. Yes, men's rights activists. And you make a very good case for men's rights in your own video. And if there's black men or black women watching this video, could you comment down below that is it necessary if you are a black person or a woman to have that kind of attitude? You can already see that in this short clip. Men's rights activists, does that really exist? Yes, we do exist. This might come as a shock to you, but men actually have less rights than women do. Think about that. I mean seriously, y'all don't think y'all already have enough shit? Right back at ya! Here are some of the things that we don't have. Uh, equal parenting rights. You can cut up our genitals when we are infants. We have to sign up for a draft, go to army or something like that on a lot of countries while you women can stay at home. We get more prison time for equal crime. So that's four things right out of my, my head without even thinking about it that much. Yeah, I got basketball, football. Well, women can play basketball and they do have, you know, you're probably an American. Uh, they have NBA for women. It's not anywhere near as popular as men's NBA. But hey, what can you do? Baseball, damn near every major sport. Yeah, I got priests, presidents, nearly every justice in Supreme Court. As I said, uh, women get less jail time for equal crime. Child custody cases, most of them go to women. So what good does it, uh, in men's point of view, what good does it do to have men in Supreme Courts if everything goes to women. Could you uh, show me one or two examples of Supreme Court doing something positive to men? And I'm just one man talking about this stuff. But if you ask me, we could get all female presidents and uh, Supreme Court ju uh, judges and stuff like that if that means that we get less time than you do for the same crimes uh, child custody cases goes to men's favor um, you go do the do the war thing you have to sign up for the draft stuff like that you know be my guest I mean like for like y'all make 20% more I'm really having a hard time seeing what y'all arguing for. Divorce is unfair. Child custody is unfair. This 12 criminal case is only for women. Honestly, I really don't care. Until you have a period, bear children, or get a pay cut, y'all just emotional crybaby madmen that need to shut the fuck up. You shut the fuck up. Terrence Bob uh, said in one of his videos that 85% of men after child custody hearings, blah blah blah, uh, see their children less than 35%. So 85% of men see their children less than 35% of the time. Now, I would assume that if you would go ask thousand, a thousand women that would they rather have their children for 65% of the time instead of 35 and uh, or would they rather uh, be without periods which is, which is of course none of men's fault it's nature and the pay gap of course a feminist video can't be complete without a pay gap myth 
If you're so stupid that you know that you get paid less than a man for the exact uh, same work because you're a woman and you <laughs> there's an equal pay act been since 1963 I guess so if you're that stupid that you don't take that further to your boss and uh, sue them you know, that's your fault and of course women never ever talk about that you are spending what 80% 83% of all purchases so if you make less money than men how come you spend so much more is it uh, is it your husband's money your father's money your boyfriend's money and uh, you asked do men's rights activists really exist yes because as you well showed us that we can't wait for feminists to fix anything because you only see yourself oppressed for things like for things that don't exist like the pay gap so don't tell me that lie about glass ceilings not being true because hillary already cracked it next time we're breaking through i want to see that you are breaking through the glass ceiling I can't remember who it was and he said something about that when women have glass ceilings then men have glass cellars or floors because men do all the or almost all of the dangerous and dirty works you know when you are coming through that glass ceiling does that mean that there are gonna be more female oil rig workers uh, more fisher women camera women women uh, sanitary workers that are women or does that mean that you just want all the good jobs in terms of being safe in an office good pay stuff like that Yeah. <laughs> uh, thanks for watching. Bye.